Hello friends, the topic for today is model based reflex agents in AI. Model or state based agents differ from perceptive agents in that such agents maintain some sort of state based on the percept sequence received so far. Agenda for today's video. Introduction, structure of the model based reflex agent, the agent program, discussion and summary. Let us start with the introduction. The most effective way to handle partial observability is for the agent to keep track of the part of the world it can't see now. That is the agent should maintain some sort of internal state that depends on the percept history and thereby reflects at least some of the unobserved aspects of the current state. The state is updated regularly based on what the agent senses and the agent's action. Keeping track of the state requires that agent has a knowledge about how the world evolves and how the agent's action affect the world. This knowledge about how the world evolves and how agent's action affect the world or how the world works, whether implemented in simple Boolean circuits or in complete scientific theories is called model of the world. Agent that uses such model is called model based agent or state based agent. Then let us go to the structure of the model based reflex agent. Figure 1 shows the structure of the model based reflex agent with internal state showing how the current percept is combined with the old internal state to generate the updated description of the current state based on the agent's model of the how the world works. Now here in this figure we use the rectangles to denote the current internal state of the agent's decision process and overs to represent the background information used in the process. Here the sensors are used to obtain the current percepts from the environment. Then the current percept is combined with the old internal state to generate the updated description of the current state based on the agent's model of how the world works. This is shown with the overs how the world evolves and what my actions do. The agent triggers action through actuators based on the condition action rules and updated description of the current state represented by what action I should do now. Then let us go to the agent program. The agent program is shown in figure 2. The interesting part is the function update state which is responsible for creating the new internal state description. The function takes current state, the most recent action and the model which is description of how the next state depends on the current state and action. The function Model based agent takes percept as parameter and returns an action based on updated state and condition action rules. Then let us go to the discussions. The details of how models and states are represented vary widely depending on the type of environment and the particular technology used in the agent design. Regardless of the kind of representation used, it is seldom possible for agents to determine the current state of the partially observable environment exactly. Instead, the box label what the world is like now represents the agent's best guess or sometimes best guesses. For example, an automated taxi may not be able to see around the large truck that has stopped in front of it and can only guess about what may be the causing the holdup. Thus, the uncertainty about the current state may be unavoidable but the agent still has to make a decision. A perhaps less obvious point about the internal state maintained by the model based agent is that it does not have to describe what the world is like now in a literal sense. Then let us go to the summary. Thus a state based agent works as follows. Information comes from sensor percepts. Then based on this the agent changes the current state of the world and based on the state of the world and knowledge that is memory it triggers action through the effectors or actuate so with this we come to the end of this video if you like the video press the like button share with your friends and subscribe to our channel engineering and technology forum and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you get notifications for our future videos on this subject then thanks for watching have a nice day